Technology, JavaScript, and front end evangelist, slash guru, slash ninja shogun, slash thinker, slash self described best engineer of all time at Stultis Network Solutions in Milford, Connecticut, Mark VJ! somebody we want to make a website about tonight from this section over here who's somebody in the news or in popular culture Ellie! Okay, Ellie! okay. Ellie! Ellie! good first of all you're not in the section I pointed to but I'll never listen to you <laughs> you failed <laughs> you missed your chance I come in every section and you blew it <laughs> <laughs> this isn't a freaking improv show. I'm allowed to say no. <laughs> and you think you're freaking better than me? You think you're smarter than me? And you're not. <laughs> From this section over here. Somebody in the audience uh, have a suggestion that's better than whatever he was gonna say. Paul. Who? Palsy. 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 There's a pop star named Halsey? <laughs> Does anybody from this section know Halsey? <laughs> nope? <laughs> Princess Diana has that this website's gonna be about. Hiccups. Hiccups? Yeah. Princess Diana's cure to hiccups? <laughs> hey! Okay, so the website, Princess Diana Cures Hiccups.org. That's our that's our charity that organization that we're building today. Now for the first uh, five rows. <laughs> So the first, the headline on Princess Diana Cures Hiccups.org, what's the headline? Words, uh, like the headline like you might read on the newspapers. Hold your breath. Hold your breath. <laughs> image we see at the top of the page, the big image uh, behind the headline. There's a big something that grabs you that says, 
makes me want to spend money when I'm on this website? A tiara. A tiara. <laughs> okay, and now, there's something unusual about this tiara. It's not just a normal tiara. There's something unusual about it. What's a, 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 an abnormality or something fun about it? It has, it has, a, it has a mouth! <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so from over here, uh, throughout the rest of the website, there are other images, okay? They might be the mascot of this charity, something completely unrelated to what was uh, said earlier. A yarmulke. A yarmulke. <laughs> completely unrelated, I'll take it. Okay, and just um, from... <laughs> I see you consoling the people you're with. <laughs> From over here, I'll give you a chance. What's something interesting about this yarmulke? And Nelly! I... Nelly? Nelly. Nelly. Nelly is on the yarmulke. <laughs> Nelly is on the yarmulke. We're wearing the yarmulke. Tip toe. Tip toe? Tip toe. <laughs> what the hell are we doing? <laughs> I made a mistake. <laughs> with a mouth. And then throughout the website, there are other images of yarmulkes that may or may not have something to do with Nelly. <laughs> and there will be no mention of Halsey. <laughs> programmed me to say that. Oh, and if you think that this guy reminds you of Jarvis from Iron Man, uh, good, because he should. Uh, Iron Man rocks! 
<laughs> I hate DC, am I right? <laughs> to extent, let me just say that the Spider-Man pinball machine is like way better than this Batman pinball machine. Um, and, uh, well, actually what I meant by that is that the Batman pinball machine is like superior to the Avengers pinball machine. So in some ways DC is like better than Marvel, in some ways Marvel is better than DC. And I guess... <laughs> anyway, what I'd like to say now, uh, before I move on, uh, because I know it's important for everybody on the, be the same page, <laughs> we will not be talking about hardware once during this show because uh, <clears throat> I'm not that uh, kind of engineer. <laughs> Christopher Walken. <laughs> what do you mean you are not that kind of engineer? I don't do hardware, Clipster, okay? You know, mother, fathers, and rams, and power outlets, and all that. I am a front-end engineer. I write code that runs websites. You see the freaking difference over here? Uh, okay, I paint paintings. I don't build canvases. Uh, I am like an expert in JavaScript canvas, humble brag, I guess. Uh. Perhaps you should explain what we will be talking about tonight, Mark. Okay, Clipster, don't rush me. What is this temple run? <laughs> Basically, what you need to know is that you, i.e. the user, open your computer, i.e. the client, launch a browser, i.e. 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 Internet Explorer, and type in a URL, i.e. <laughs> your computer, i.e. the client, sends that URL, i.e. uniform resource locator, and HTTP, i.e. hypertext transfer protocol request in the World Wide Web, i.e. Internet to find the machine, i.e. computer that hosts, i.e. serves that website, i.e. the server. <laughs> the machine, i.e. computer, i.e. the server, receives that HTTP, i.e. hypertext transfer protocol request, and returns an HTTP, i.e. hypertext transfer protocol response with files that are rendered, i.e. displayed on your, i.e. the user's computer, i.e. the client. <laughs> <laughs> Money to understand how the internet works. <laughs> Wendy Osmani is an accomplished engineer at Google. Don't explain my jokes, Clipster! You designed me to be this way. Okay! <laughs> our domain. We're going to need to register in the DNS. Uh, GoDaddy is the most popular domain name registrar, but uh, they stink worse than a lazily written prototype.gs plugin. <laughs> <laughs> Instead, we're going to be using Name.com. Name.com is an incredible website. Name.com. Tell me more. Thank you, Clipster. I plan to. <laughs> Don't you just love companies that have unbeatable prices and award-winning customer service? I do. Okay, so let's go over to Name.com and make our was our website awaits. Look at these happy people. Okay, <laughs> Princess. Oh, the typer. Princess. How many ends? One. Thank Five. you. Five. Princess Diana cures pick ups. Okay, here we go. Scratching my ear. And, uh, okay. Oh, wait a minute. $12.99? That's way too expensive. Oh, wait a minute. Dot store? Hold on. I'm very curious as to what XYZ is. Uh, let's go ahead and do uh, dot club. Because, hey, that's what name.com gives you. <laughs> <laughs> this show is seriously sponsored by Name.com. I got swag. Who wants some swag? Here's one. These are credit card. These are not credit. These are credit card holders to the back of your phone. The adhesive is very weak. Okay, I've got, I've got two. I've got one more, and I'm not getting any more refills because the guy I was in contact with got laid off. Uh, <laughs> it's very real. Okay. <laughs> Hold on a second, sorry. <laughs> oh crap! Ah <laughs> oh, crap! Huh? Oh, maybe. What? <laughs> My uh, 
anybody from my ward needs me, I'm pretty much the Steve Wozniak of my company, except very handsome and recognized. <laughs> Steve Wozniak played a crucial, yet underappreciated role in the development of Apple computers. Yeah, Clipster, that's the joke! That's why everyone's freaking laughing. <laughs> <laughs> websites on my computer. I store them deep inside my hard drive to avoid from hack attacks. <laughs> you gotta get inside their minds. You gotta know what they want. <laughs> what they need. You gotta think like a mouse. <laughs> Thanks for walking. Mouse club. <laughs> okay, so I'm a hacker and I'm on the first thing you do when you're hacking is you look at the desktop, and I'm thinking, oh crap, what if these folders am I going to open? There's so many folders here. Which one could have all the websites on it? This guy's got all the cool websites. Which one's going to be? Maybe the unassuming folder? Oh, the untitled folder? Yeah, there's nothing inside that. Do not open? Uh oh I'm going to back away there, but I'm a bad boy. Blue pill, red pill? I want this journey to continue. Red pill, the right folder, the wrong folder? Uh-oh, the wrong folder. Uh, no, let's go in at night. Nice. You pick the right folder. <laughs> or so you think. Do not open this. Uh, do. I told you not to open this. Standoff nudes, Pokemon Snap cheats, Samurai bits. Uh, yeah, there's no way to cheat in Pokemon Snap. <laughs> you chose wisely. Now try this on for size. Whoa. <laughs> oh, I even just copied one by accident. Untitled Pokemon number two. Yeah, because it's always number two. Which is my bot services list now, bitch. Uh, yeah, no one wants to open that. Boom, my website folder. <laughs> <laughs> you don't need Norton antivirus when you've got folders. <laughs> so, obviously, we're going to be starting with the simple, the basic building block of the internet, the HTML. Uh, oh, and oh, before say anything else at this point, I just want to make extremely clear, no, this is not code yet. No, 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 I'm code. <laughs> it might look like code if you're freaking John McCain or something. <laughs> John McCain is an elderly U.S. senator who you have to assume is computer illiterate. Might be too soon to say that. So, uh... <laughs> HTML stands for hacking the time of my life. Uh, 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 uh. JK grueling, but seriously, I am a hacker. I am having the time of my life. Uh. HTML stands for hypertext markup language. Mister, okay, they get it. Uh, there's so many HTML elements to choose from. There's ah, bo, the do, big, her, ol, ku, whiver, frank. So here we go. We obviously are going to be starting with the doc type, which is what we start with every time. Uh, not important, Mark. Skip to the fun. <laughs> Okay, next we've got the HTML element. Jeez, Mark, you're boring them! <laughs> uh, and then the first element inside the HTML is always the head, and the second is always the body. And you can think about it like this. The head is like your head. That's the information you can't see. Whereas the body is the information you, like, you can see. Just like, uh, like you. I, I know you got stuff in your mind that I can't see. But I can see your body. <laughs> that was needlessly uncomfortable. Okay. Uh, so what we're going to be doing is basically building the general scaffolding of this website. We're going to be filling it within the details that we discussed earlier or later. <clears throat> I know it's very complex, impressive JavaScript module that's going to be auto-generating those images we talked about. Very impressive, but we'll get to that later. Okay, so first, we're going to have that H1, which is the heading, and we're going to have that beautiful heading which is, uh, uh, was it take a breath, was it? Hold your breath. Hold your breath, okay, thank you so much. Uh, hold your breath, okay, and then, guess what, if you want another header that's just a little bit smaller, that's H2. <laughs> <laughs> uh, hold your breath, the best is yet to come. <laughs> uh, now is the perfect time to save, which reminds me of the golden rule of programming. Always have a backup. Ugh. Every freaking noob knows that. Ugh. Okay, so I'm going to save this. Okay, let's go to desktop. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, give it a good name, like 
wow syntax highlighting, and here we go! Oh, it's nice when it works. Okay, next, uh, we've got the, which stands for paragraph. And um, what a lot of people use when they're scaffolding on a website is this is this filler text called lorem ipsum, okay? It's Latin boring filler text. I invented my own filler text generator called markvgenipsum.net. It's a real website you can go to. Um, and it's just more interesting than boring old Latin. <laughs> <laughs> Give me a second, I need to make sure it has all the <laughs> Looking for representation. <laughs> okay, we press save and go back to our thing, and boom, there we go! There's a lot of potential there. Okay, next we've got A, which stands for anchor, which has an attribute href, which stands for hypertext reference. And if this naming convention isn't confusing to you yet, then you're a freaking idiot, okay? <laughs> Seriously, what were these smoking and can I have some? <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm going to be building into my favorite website, Bing.com. This is my fave site. Okay. And we'll refresh here. Bam! That's a link. Okay. Now I'm going to click it because I don't need to know where it goes. Okay, great. Next, we've got uh, uh, one of my favorite elements of all time. A lot of people say it's deprecated. I don't know what that word means. <laughs> uh, it's called the marquee, and let me just put it in here. Uh, Princess Diana Moreline <laughs> Di <laughs> Di <laughs> HTML is used to syntactically organize content. The different elements help you describe what makes your content different. Right, Eclipser, that's what I've been saying this whole freaking time. Like, you don't know, you know, have to be freaking Paul Irish to understand what Eclipser's talking about. Paul Irish is a JavaScript engineer on the Google Chrome team. Stop explaining my jokes, Eclipser! You programmed me to be this way. <laughs> Clipster, what was that? Running a systems diagnostic. 
Mark, the memory pressure on the computer is abnormally high. We may experience slowness. Uh, okay, that's, uh, something I guess we can take care of later, blah, blah, blah. I shall flush the cache and seek memory hogging applications. Okay, yeah, uh, that sounds like a hardware thing. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I need a new file. A uh, CSS file. <laughs> CSS stands for cool style, Stephen. <laughs> What'd you say? <laughs> Somebody not shout on it. I thought someone shouted something and then interrupted the show. <laughs> well, that's awkward, and I'm gonna sit here until somebody laughs. <laughs> Great, okay, well, CSS stands for cool style, Stephen. Uh, JK, but seriously, uh, my dad's name is Stephen, and he's really handsome. <laughs> so. CSS stands for cascading style sheets. The rules you apply to an element cascade to its children. Oh, right. I didn't mention this earlier. Elements that are inside other elements are called their children. Uh, just like how you might have children one day. <laughs> Why do you keep doing that? I haven't talked to anybody all day, so I'm a little cray. <laughs> okay, oh, and before we get into the CSS stuff, let me just say one thing very quickly. No, this is not code yet. <laughs> Whenever I make styles, I like to sing a little song to myself. Here we go. I'm singing a song about style sheet, and we're gonna make the body color. Oh, baby. supply could erase everything. Okay, well the power supply is fine, the show's almost freaking over, and there's only one thing left. That's right, the JavaScript. JavaScript is so awesome. <laughs> I got a fever. <laughs> <laughs> and the only prescription is more JavaScript. People are on the my spot. Mark, I am so sorry to interrupt, but we are limited on time. You are going to need to skip this segment. Skip the JavaScript? Clips are we freaking nuts? I'm allergic to nuts, so stay the frick away. <laughs> if you must demonstrate JavaScript, you have exactly one minute. Can't code in under a minute, can I? I'll show you who can't code in under a minute! I never said you could not do it. I said... It's on! Initiate hack mode. <laughs> Very impressive, Mark. 
thank you, Clipster. And so there's probably no mistakes in this because I never make mistakes. Mark, so. I do not think the audience gains anything from your hyperbolic descriptions of your own abilities. Clipster, talk to the hand because the fish don't want to hear it anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I invented that joke. A lot of people know that. <laughs> uh, well, anyway, I did it, everybody. <laughs> It's not done rendering, it's not on the internet yet, but promise, I promise it's going to be really good. And I don't think that it's ever been too bad to crack the champagne a second early. <laughs> <laughs> yourself to be perfect. We all have shortcomings and that's why we need to work together. That's beautiful. You designed me to say that. Okay. <laughs> that is completely intact. you freaking saved me. I'm just doing my part. The hardware and data side. You are the front end engineer. We make a great team. Though a little modesty on your part might not hurt. Okay. Now let's launch this motherfucking website with <laughs> match. There's a Wi-Fi, uh, it's, uh, I believe it's dot .public Wi-Fi, uh, no password. We're going to go to Princess Diana Cures Hiccups Club and uh, let's see how we did here. You might get there before I do because let's just say the internet here uh, is, uh, well, you know. Okay, Cures Hiccups Club. Remember, one N. One N, two C's. <laughs> Okay, and here we go. <laughs> As you can see, uh, uh, a tiny arrow with a mouth that says hold your breath. We've got a whole bunch of buttons here that allow you to donate. I took the liberty of making the cursor my face. <laughs> so that's something you don't get on mobile. Uh, and so uh, that's 
palsy for <laughs> personal website, markvegion.com or uh, markvegion.biz uh, <laughs> or markvegion.club to join my fan club or this is markvegion.lol <laughs> markvegion.org if you love affecting change or markvegion.info if you just hate pictures uh, this is markvegion.live if you love Kinky Boots the musical uh, this is markvegion.co if you're a startup kind of person uh, News is for leftists, uh, or is for This is a website that everybody can agree is free. Uh, and so yeah, just uh, find my email there and send me some feedback. I gotta go clean up Mountain Dew off my laptop. Thank you so much.